Jesus Christ and believe in the same God. And we should not bash each other. We should love each other. Well, even the devils believe in God and they tremble, right? No, no, no. No, the scriptures say that. The Bible. Well, yeah, I know that he says that. But we shouldn't bash other believers if we believe in the Lord Jesus Christ. I mean, if you believe in whatever X, Y, Z, I see the point. Yeah. But if we believe in the Lord Jesus Christ, we are brothers and sisters in Christ. Well, not everyone's a brother and sister because, like I said, even the devils believe in God and they tremble. I mean, if you believe that, I'm just saying it's not kind. Yeah. But Jesus called out the religious leaders. They believed in God. The Pharisees well, believed in God. If you call each other to hold witnesses in the moment, yeah. I get that. Yeah. But not believers in God. Yeah, but wait, did the Pharisees, they believed in God? Yeah, but not in Jesus Christ. Yeah, well, Jesus, that's what I'm saying. These people in here, they're not believing in the Jesus of the Bible. Yes, they not the true Jesus. Yes, they do. I've been coming here yeah. for seven years. Every year. Why you don't go inside? It's free. They won't let us inside. They won't well, let us maybe inside. Maybe because of the attitude. No. So but let me ask you this. Did Jesus tell everyone to repent or perish? Of course. So what about if they don't repent in there? Do they go to... Why shall they repent? They have done anything wrong. They, oh, they, they come, the come out... They come out here cussing. They come no, out here I with the... I don't know who you're talking I'm to. I'm talking about the other people in there. They come out there with their breasts hanging out of their shirts, tight clothes. I'm sorry. Yeah. I don't see those type of yeah. people. Yeah. Oh, out. they're in They're in there. They're in there. But then even you... Trying to fight us. But should we... Should we judge the people? We were sinners. And we still sin every day. Well, that's false. And in God's forgiveness. That's false, though. It doesn't say that in the Bible. Yes, it does. Where does it say that, that we sin every day in the Bible? You are redeemed, but we are all human beings and we make mistakes. But where does it say that in the Bible? It seems like everywhere in the Bible. Where? Let's say, get in an argument with my husband. It's wrong. Right? Yeah, but did. So you repent. But when you get in an argument, is that a free will choice? That's your choice to get in an argument yeah, or you're forced? we're human beings and we do those things. So yeah. we have a choice. To repent, is that, I'm sorry, I said I shouldn't have said that. I repent, and yeah. God forgives you because He loves you. Yeah, but you don't have to do that all the time, though. It's a choice. No, but with you, yeah, you can't use that as an excuse. Christ came in the same flesh as us. He came as God manifested in the flesh. Yeah. If we had the Spirit of God in us. He can help us with yeah, all sin. Of course he will. And he does. But we do dumb things. Right? You are in traffic. You lose your temper. But you, you don't have do to do that, though. It's a choice. Yeah, but you won't be perfect. The only perfect person who walked on this earth was Jesus. But why did Jesus tell us to be perfect as his heavenly father is perfect? He, he never said that. Yeah, he did. No, he never said yes, he did. He said in Matthew 5, 48. Oh, so Jesus, Jesus never said to be perfect as your heavenly father is perfect. He never said that. No, he said that. But we are humans. We make mistakes. So did he or did he not say it? He said it, but not in a way to condemn you. If you believe in Jesus Christ, there is therefore no condemnation for you anymore. If you walk in the Spirit, though. Yeah, not if you walk in the Spirit. Not if you're going in there. Not if you're going in there, ma'am.